Coco Ed Patterson. Uh, we have thumbs up. Drivers behind the line in three, two, one, go. Got a lot of love for him. But we've got robots to watch. And time waits for no man. So, without that, with that said, uh, we've got the Blue Alliance taking a small lead in this autonomous period. The bees getting that quint, uh, meaning they only need 13 more to get that bonus ranking point. The Blue Alliance coming up and in, putting two up top, only one goes in. Oh, and it takes out a sparkling water at the scoring table. What a tragedy. That's what you watch this sport for, right? The sparkling water that gets spilled. Uh, we've got three from the blue up top. Only two go in. Red responds quickly in kind. 67-53. Reloading at the blue hangar. As 33 passes through one of those blue cargo, spits it out. Two for the red, one for the blue, as they lead by 18. Red needs two more for that bonus ranking point. 71, 78, the Yetis putting up some beauties, some biscuits in the basket, if you will. 33 doing the same, but trying to get away from that defense played by 67, 53, the Robo Kings. Some quick shots from 43, 27. Hugh Branch from Lakeview and Battle Creek. Lots of shots fired from 67-53. Bees try to cancel it out. Both, all four go in. And Red leads 66 to 43 with little over half a minute left in this match. We've got two for the red, two for the blue. 71-78 going for the climb channeling their Miley Cyrus while on the blue to get into position as well. And those bumbling bees come in at the last moment for the Red Alliance on the high bar. Can they get the traversal? 10 to go. They do. We got two on the board for the Red. And with four, three, two, one, 70, 57, 12 gets it at the buzzer. Red Alliance wins this match, leading the Blue Alliance 110 to 74, earning four ranking points for the Red and one for the Blue. And with that, please give a warm round of applause to your event coordinator, Margie Jenkins.